hello guys welcome back to my youtube channel today i'm showing how we can install 3zx on our computer so it's possible to install it on different versions uh, first of all just go to www.3zx.com and we have to register and download the corresponding version that you are using so when you go down you can see there is two option whether to install it in a cloud google cloud amazon or azure account or on premise in windows linux or as a virtual machine so we are going with the second option on premise option we have a windows 10 machine and we are going to install 3zx on our windows 10 machines so you need to fill this form if it's a company you can fill here and if it's an individual you just click on the individual option and fill that form correspondingly and uh, submit and download so i have already downloaded the setup file it's in the desktop just uh, double click on this one or right click and run as administrator click yes here so it's um, showing the first window let me maximize this for you to see it clear, uh, clearly okay fine now you can see that click next it's telling the requirements like um, which is required click next again other recommendations like Google Chrome uh, gateways and all those stuffs we don't need to worry about this at present click on next I accept the terms and license agreement click on next and you can ch the default folder if you want but I'm going with the default option click next and install so it's installing the prerequisites of for the softwares so this Microsoft uh, C++ is required so just agree to the license term and install it this is um, prerequisites of our 3cx in some computers dotnet framework versions that is recommended will be required close this one and now it's proceeding with the installation it's configuring the 3cx phone system validating install it's gonna take a little more time as you can see that it's it will copy the files that are required to our computer this first video of our tutorial series regarding 3zx so uh, please keep subscribe to, s to check the more videos that are coming for configuration and uh, IP phone configurations and how to use the web console how to configure remote IP phones all this stuff we will be discussing in coming video tutorials so just to keep subscribed and uh, I will be uploading new videos in, in coming days but depending on my free time so it's installing 3zx phone system you can see the status it's copying new files and as you can see they're telling that this may take several minutes so let's wait for it to finish it We are installing the latest version as of now, version 16.0 and we are doing it on our Windows 10, okay. You can do it even in Linux or you can install it as a simple virtual machine by downloading the ISO file from the 3CX web portal now you can see it's uh, installing the documents okay now we have finished the installation you can see how we need to check the configuration how to run the tool 
So we are going with the first option using web browser. We don't go with the command line. Just click one and it will start the PBX web configuration tool. Uh, if the Chrome is available or it will open in the Chrome, if it is a default browser, otherwise it will be opening through the Microsoft Edge. You need to give permission to run it on private networks as well as public networks. So just uh, click on this one, check the option and uh, Click OK since the firewall is blocking the connection to the application. You just click private networks and uh, allow access. OK fine we have finished the installation. In coming video I will be showing how we can uh, do the initial configuration of uh, our 3CX phone system. So I hope you enjoy this video guys. Uh, like the video subscribe the channel click the bell icon for notification for more videos and take care bye goodbye